So the original video that you had posted um, about coloring smoke had you try to select this region in the back of your image um, and then to fill it with black. And the problem you were having was you were probably getting locked up because your background is not uh, quite black. And with a threshold of one, it ended up generating a very complex selection, which can chew through a lot of memory if it's really, really um, complex. A far simpler way to turn the background here to black without any kind of selections or filling is to just adjust the levels of the image. Now, if I go to uh, the color picker tool here, and GIMP, and I just click somewhere in here. Um, what I'm actually doing is sampling the colors, and an even better thing to do is hold down the Shift key as a modifier while you click in here, and what you'll get is this color picker window. And as you click and drag, you can see what the value of the pixels underneath the, uh, the cursor are. And you can see that they're all right around four at their lightest. Some are three, some are two, but roughly four. Same way over here. And what this means is, is that um, you know that if you compress the black point so that black is actually now uh, four in your image, it'll be truly black. And that's very easy to do, uh, even with just the levels tool, color levels. And what you can do is you can just change the black point to four, just like that. And with a small shift like that, what you should see with the color picker tool now is everything's mostly just black. See, zero, zero, zero. So that's your truly black background. Uh, and then at that point, you just follow the rest of the tutorial like normal. Um, you add a new layer above this. So you come down here and you say, create a new layer. You can leave it transparent if you'd like. Set the mode of the layer to overlay. And then just use a gradient fill. Pick which one you like. for instance, and then click, drag your mouse to another location, release the mouse, and it'll fill with a gradient. And there's your colored smoke.